Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I've created this makeup look with all my recently purchased makeup products. So without any further delay, let's quickly jump to the video. The first product that I'm going to talk about is this one. It is the Mars Hydra Glow Primer. The primer is so good. It is very soft on the skin. Like post application, the skin looks very soft and uh, it's very, very hydrating as well. So for color corrector, I'll be using this Swiss Beauty Orange Color Corrector. I really love Swiss Beauty products and I thought of giving this a shot. So I picked it quickly as soon as it is available so now i'm quickly going to apply this on the areas where i have hyperpigmentation and dark spots so i'm just simply color correcting in my dark circle and hyperpigmented areas that's it i'm not going to touch any of the acne marks or you know active acne that i have on my skin so for foundation i'm going to use rimmel lasting finish foundation in shade toffee Okay, now we're done with the foundation. The next I'm going to use a blush and it is from the brand called Swiss Beauty. It is their new professional blusher. So this is how the blush looks like and I have picked the shade called Glaze Bronzing. I really really love this shade and it's so gorgeous so if you're of deeper complexion I would highly recommend you to try this shade for eyeshadow I'll be using this Mars I belong in your purse eyeshadow palette in Varian soft glam so this is how the shade looks like it has got this beautiful soft shades so if you're looking for a really subtle eye makeup then you can definitely try this one and I'm going to start by picking this shade so I'm going to use it as a transition shade on my crease area and I'm going to take the same shade on the, the lower eyelids as well next I'm going to use the shade to add some depth Next, I'm going to take uh, this soft champagne shade and then I'm going to apply it from the inner corner till the middle of my eyelids and then I'm going to blend it. So I'm quickly going to take the same shade with a pointing brush and then I'm going to apply it on the inner corner of my eyelids and then a little bit on my brow bone area. Next for my kajal, I'm going to use this Milani Stay Put Waterproof Eyeliner. Now this one is extremely jet black in shade. This eyeliner is so pigmented. It has got this intense black pigmentation. Now I'm going to tight line my upper and lower waterline using this kajal. Next for my eyeliner, I'm going to use this Lacme Iconic Eyeliner. I really love the way this eyeliner works. It has got this very thin tip and it's very very flexible so you can draw very thin lines. So basically if you're struggling with drawing thin lines using your eyeliner, I would highly recommend you to try this product and the Maybelline Colossal Eyeliner. Both have very thin and uh, you know very flexible tip so that you can draw a very fine line so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to draw a very thin line near my lash line this is your lashes and this area is called this lash line so i'm going to draw a very very thin line So 
next we are going to apply mascara and now i'm going to show you an amazing amazing mascara but this one is very less straight or less height i don't know why it is not so hyped in the market because this one is such a stunning amazing mascara if you're watching this video if you're planning to buy a really good quality mascara which gives you that voluminous you know lengthy beautiful wispy lashes then i would highly recommend you to try this one this is such such a stunning mascara so the product that i'm talking about is this one this is the face shop fresh in big mascara so this is how the wand of this mascara looks like so now you guys are going to see how this one is going to turn my eyelashes when i apply this mascara i don't even need false lashes because it just lift my lashes curls and then you know it gives that beautiful lengthened curled voluminous effect now you will see that so hope you guys can see the difference this eye is with mascara and this eye without mascara you know now you can see how this mascara widely open your eyes so yeah i really really love this product that's it we are into the final step and finally for my lipstick i'm going to use this one this is the spiss beauty uh, hd lipstick i think i'll put all the details in the description box you can definitely go ahead and check it there so this is a spiss beauty lipstick in shade brandy harrington so now i'm going to apply it on my lips So now I'm going to define my lips using a lip liner and for which I'll be using this Miss Claire Glimmer Stick Lip Liner in shade a Coffee Brown. So that's it we're done with this makeup look and this is how it turned out i really really love the way it looks hope you guys really love this content if you like it please give a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do subscribe immediately and also don't forget to click on the bell icon so yes with that i'm signing off next time with another beautiful content i'll meet you guys and let's bye from priya bye bye